Hey guys, Mars Engine here bringing another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. And so yes, that's right, once again, it's back. Everyone's favourite game mode. That joke will never get old because... I mean, there are actually some people that like Chain Battle, but those people are crazy and should not be trusted. But Chain Battle is back once again. We have the giant uh, ape baby. Uh, we're going to go ahead and jump in here. We're going to set up our supporters and then um, see how we get on. So just to show uh, on here before we start jumping into the units, GT Heroes, Pure Saiyans and Terrifying Conquerors are the uh, bonus units. So obviously for the super type, you're going to want GT Heroes and Pure Saiyans. Uh, the best units to use are basically all the Super Saiyan 4 Gokus. So we're going to go ahead and select Pure Saiyans, Goku Family, and then let's just do Giant 8 Power, I guess. I could put GT Heroes on there as well, because obviously that really sort of narrows it down. Um, as you can see, all these guys have the red. So we might as well throw in you, you, you. I suppose actually, if I have a spare copy of you, SA5, ready for the uh, easy A super attacks, I should probably reverse you. So basically, the best connectors are going to be all your Super Saiyan 4 Gokus. If you have the TUR or SSR versions of the new LR, uh, even the old LR, um, the full power one as well. And then after those, it drops down to being the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. There's the physical one as well, um, the Super Saiyan 3 one. So I guess I can take off Giant 8 power. Yeah, this guy. Uh, but then, yeah, I think because I don't have any... Uh, I don't have any of the, like, reversed SSR versions. So when it comes to the best connectors, I think those are pretty much my main ones here. So... I'm not sure what the best way to fill the rest of it out is going to be then. I guess we could just use the other Super Saiyan 3 Gokus. Because, yeah, I don't really have any spare TURs of um, these, like, Super Saiyan 4s or anything. But if I... Let's just reverse my um, Super Saiyan 3. Let's do this guy. Because he'll still be better on the team than one of those other Gokus. Oh, there you go. The news is updated finally. Yeah, so we'll take off you. Put you on there. Yeah, so as you can see, I only have, like, the three actual, like, awakened, full, like, Super Saiyan 4 Gokus. I don't have any spare copies of any of them, so... Not the best super type connectors for me on this one, I'm afraid. Uh, and then when it comes to the extreme, uh, we obviously want pure Saiyans and terrifying conquerors. So it's going to be uh, the best ones are all uh, Great Ape Vegetas. Uh, the Great Ape Raditz is in like the C tier. Gallic Gun Vegeta is actually above uh, Raditz. So it's mostly Vegetas, right? So we want Great Ape Vegeta. Great Ape Vegeta. This guy, the Super Strike one is in like B tier. Um, we can bring him. Gallic Gun Vegeta's up there. Then we got Vegeta and Nappa, funnily enough. There they are. Although Nappa isn't, because I have the TUR. Nappa's in like D tier. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of these are, a lot of the best connectors are just like the reversed versions of like the Vegetas and stuff, which is a little bit annoying because, you know, I'm not someone that keeps a lot of these SSRs. Um, AGL Turles is in C tier. Interesting that he is, but Physical Turles isn't. And then Great Ape Turles is in D tier. So I guess we'll throw him in there as well. And then... I'm surprised I don't have a second. I probably do have a Gallic Gun Vegeta randomly somewhere. But... but there you go. I don't like Chain Battle, to be honest, because it's too boring. I mean, yeah, it is, this first part is kind of annoying, right? Doing the setup. Um, but there you go. Got our supporters. And let's see. Now, the best thing to do always when you're jumping into Chain Battle is honestly, if you want to try and get a high score as possible, 
um, then you want to uh, wait a little bit, I think, because then you're able to go ahead and check what other people have done, right, by going into battle info, battle result. Now, because we're literally right when it started, these haven't been updated, so if I come out of it, go back in, get some updated scores here. Because, yeah, this will give you an idea of the best attackers and um, supporters. Although it still hasn't really updated because these are all... Well, we got 133 million on here, 136. AGL LR Goku. Interesting. Now, according to the list that I'm looking at... They're both using... Yeah, he's using the tech one. 145 is with the AGL LR. That's interesting. But anyway, let's go ahead and jump in. So the list that I'm looking at here, I'll put a link to this in the description. But um, shout out to Piccolo Sama for this. Uh, but the best attacker is the tech full power Goku, apparently. So let's put him in there. I should have filled with this way more because I have no idea where he's going to be. There we go. All right, let's see. So there's Toon. Our boy has a full Super Saiyan 4 lineup. That's what we like to see. We want to find a full Super Saiyan 4 lineup. So obviously Chain Battle is always going to be one of those things where you're only going to get the best results if you have like the friends that have all of the units, right? And it's pretty annoying. Um, you guys saw when I was setting up my connectors that the... Um, that like I, you know, by not having a bunch of the spare unawakened versions, I only had like four or five Super Saiyan 4s. So kind of difficult to get that best setup. Um, bring it down saying AGL Goku is the best one to use. I mean, the tier list that this guy has made that makes all of these guides um, has Goku, uh, full power Goku is listed as SS. And then LR AGL Goku is listed as S plus. So he's the next best one, apparently. Um, and someone did ask in the comments, why is Tech Full Power better than AGL Super Saiyan 4? Um, and in the reply, he just says, join my Discord. I explain a lot about it over there. But he basically is confirming that he is the better one, right? And then best Super Connector um, is the new LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku. If you don't have him, then it's the Tech Full Power Goku. So I guess when you look at the attackers like Sheet, um, if you have tech full power Goku and AGL LR Goku, but you don't have the new LR, then you want to use the AGL Goku as the attacker and the tech Goku as the connector, because that's how they rank better, because, um, AGL, uh, the AGL Goku is a worse connector, um, and then when it comes to extreme, uh, the best connectors are going to be the LR Great 8 Vegeta, or the AGL, like TUR, Great 8 Vegeta. So, obviously, we want our supporters to be as many Great 8 Vegetas as possible. Our boy Dr. Pritch, 143 million first try. I rest now. Yeah, that's what you want. Um, Alright, so this guy has, like, basically all of the top units. Let's see what the numbers are for this. 66, 2, and 28. Now, is there anyone that has... I don't think we're probably going to likely to get much better than that, to be honest. Because he's got the TUR of the... Uh, as, the as the SSR, actually, of the LR. This guy has similar. What was it? 66 to 28. 75 to 29. Okay, that's... Well, there you go. All right, well, let's jump in and see what we can get on the first try. <laughs> Good old chain battle. You love to see it. Let's see. Ideally, you know, for most people, your goal is probably just going to be get the 100 million points and then you've at least completed the missions. Um, of course, the higher percentage, like, bracket you finish in, the better rewards you get at the end. But unfortunately, especially with this one, with all of the, like, Super Saiyan 4 Gokus as the required for the friend like unless you have those good friends um it's going to be difficult to find but there's a couple of people shout out to them on twitter people like piccolo sama um the what's, what's his name the russian guy is it um it's not actually russian but there's dbc archie um 
forgotten what his name is now. Is it Brother Russia? Which is a pretty funny name. Um, yeah, Brother Russia. These There are these people that have, like, a Discord server that is all the chain battle, like, whales. Um, and those people will, like, accept friend requests just so you can get your chain battle score. And then they'll, like, remove you and add other people so people can get their high scores, right? So there you go. We got 142 on the first try. Um... Was it, what did you say, Dr. Pritch? You got 143. Oof, we're just one behind. 122 million, I'll take it. I have the AGL Rainbow and the AGL TUR Rainbow. Nice. If I don't have the Tech Goku, but I have both the AGL and in LR Super Saiyan 4. Um, in that instance, then you would go, um, you go back to the guide here. So if you have the Tech one and the AGL, um, I guess it depends, because the Tech one is the best attacker and the best connector. So... I guess it's you just just one or the other. I guess in that instance, maybe the AGL was the attacker and then the tech is the connector. Um, but yeah, it's basically the tech full power Goku is the best attacker and connector if you don't have the int LR. If you have the int LR, he's the best connector and the tech one's the best attacker. So I know a lot of people did summon for that LR Goku, but obviously some people either didn't or, like me, got very unlucky. And of course I had the stones to keep going but not everybody will so if you don't have the int goku that's you know understandable um i'll put the link for those of you that want to see it that are in the stream i'll put the link in the uh, chat so you can see the tier list guide and i'll put the link in the description so if you're watching the recorded version of the video um, i'll put that down below so the only good thing about the flexibility with those super class attackers is one of the big issues with chain battle that I often find is you get that one good attempt and then you can't really do any more um, because you can't use the same connector again, right? So we can't use the in LR Goku as a connector anymore. But what I can now do is change the attacker. We can change him to the AGL Super Saiyan 4 Goku. And now we can use the tech full power Goku as the connector, right? So we have a couple more uh, full Super Saiyan 4 lineups here. So this one is 77135. 76133. Yep, so that one's better. Yeah, a lot of these people that have the DBC in front of their name, they're from this chain battle um, server. Because deep there was the guy I was saying deep before as DBC Archie as well. Um, and then for the extreme, again, you want a full Vegeta lineup if possible. Um, Nappa is in the A tier, so. I mean, to be fair, the two S tier connectors or the two S tier uh, supports are both the Great Eight Vegetas, and then everyone else is worse than that anyway. So if they have both the Great Eight Vegetas, um, that is obviously a good place to start. Um, so let's see. Raditz, you have Raditz. You have Raditz. Ideally, you don't. Raditz is like C tier, so ideally, you don't want Raditz in there. You basically want full Vegetas, but. Um, Nappa is like okay. My money don't jiggle jiggle, it falls. This is the same person. And then yeah, because I've already used the tech LR, I have to use the AGLTUR as the connector. So 63322. Where was the other Vegeta one? 66327. Alright, let's give that a try. Because, yeah, sometimes uh, that is the thing that does annoy me the most about Chain Battle is the fact that you get that one try. And then depending on how restrictive it is on the attackers and connectors, you basically don't get another, like, solid attempt unless you reset. And one of the other things I think is really annoying about Chain Battle and always has been is you don't get to have another try until you've done all of the ones you have. You can't, like, use a stone to refresh um, and refresh all your like supporters and connectors and stuff until you've used all of your attempts Which I think is odd like if you could I would just use it straight away Like if I was actually trying to farm for a high score I don't want to have to play through the like two or three extra quote-unquote like dead runs at the end in order to get um, To the point where I can then reset, but there you go I mean that one got 130 million and that was using the Secondary tier I guess of like the because we used the optimal attacker and connector for the first one Secondary one, we still got just under 130 million. Obviously, it's going to take some time for the leaderboard to settle and everything for us to really know what the top like 1% bracket is going to be. 
Um, so if you are watching this video, if you do end up, if you are currently in the top two to three percent, um, let us know down below what the bracket is, because obviously people who are maybe very close to it are going to want to know, you know, what score they need to get in order to uh, get to that top one percent. So, um, but yeah, unfortunately, once you have done that first one, uh, the next best connector is the AGL LR after the tech full power. So. I guess we can put you back to being the Goku. Because at least you can use the same attacker over and over again. But can we get another full Super Saiyan 4 Goku lineup? That's the question. The extreme one is going to be the one that will be the hardest. Just because the after you've used the two Great 8 Vegetas, they're like the two best... Um, the two best attackers for extreme. So once you've used both of them, then you're kind of in a bit of a tough spot can we get one that someone does someone have full vegetas and not reddits yeah these D, we're seeing a lot of these dbc people popping up tune didn't pop up for me the first time but his is quite clearly the best and then the next best attacker after the great eight vegetas is apparently this guy the agl uh, retro vegeta is the next best attacker so that's interesting. We'll try this and then I'll just I'll do the other two throwaway runs like off the recording, right? Because no one really needs to see those. But if we can get over 100 million with this setup, that would be good. Just to show you guys a couple of the different um, setups. Because obviously, again, not everyone has the new LR. Um, let's see. Always want to get the, full power, uh, the Super Saiyan 4 Gokus. Just because they're going to share the most links. If you end up trying to like right, quickly tap different Vegetas, some of them are going to be like not the Great Eight ones, so they're obviously going to be missing a few links that they would all share. Um, things like Saiyan Raw, Transform, stuff like that, right? So I think going for the Super Saiyan Four Goku's as the mid battle selections is probably going to be your best bet. And we still got just under 120 million. So to be honest, we did the first three attempts. We got over 100 million on all of them. So for a lot of people, you know, if you don't have the best friends, if you don't have the best setups, I know it's going to be very difficult for you to get top one percent. But as long as you're getting those uh, over 100 million scores. You're obviously then able to complete all the missions, uh, which does give a pretty decent amount of uh, the rewards to start us off here. So, yeah, let me know down below. How did you guys get on with Chain Battle? Uh, what percentage are you in? What score did you get? And as I said, if you are in that 2 to 3% bracket at the time you watch this video, let us know down below in the comment section what the score is to get into the top 1%. Um, at the time that you're making that comment. So that is going to be it for the video, guys. This has been The Master Ningen. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Check out the links down below for the Discord and the merch store, and I will see you all again soon. Have a good one.